Yo, what is good, YouTube? Welcome back to the channel. Today, I'm going over this week of content. EA hasn't dropped the official content schedule, but based off the schedule of Twitter and the NFL Combine, we have a stacked week coming up for us, and I promise you, you're not going to want to miss out on this week. I think we'll probably have content five or six days this week, which I think might be the most we've had this year. We're definitely getting the Combine because the Combine's next weekend. We're definitely getting Team of the Year because voting ends either today or tomorrow. We're getting Ultimate Legends every Saturday, weekly wild cards every Wednesday, and the Season 5 Field Pass is releasing this week as well. This week is going to be crazy, and I know you're not going to want to miss anything. So if you're new, make sure to drop a like, subscribe, tell your friends, and let's hop right in to the first promo. So as I'm recording this video, I completely forgot about the AKA Crew promo, and EA just dropped the cards over on their Twitter, and holy, the triplets, or the cowboy triplets, is this week's like theme or promo, and geez, these cards look really good. We got Emmett Smith, 96 speed, 98 excel, and then we have Troy Aikman, 80 speed, but look at these throwing stats. We don't know his abilities yet, but I'm sure EA is going to juice him to sell packs tomorrow because of the rest of the week, and they want to just drain people of their money. Now up to the LTD. This LTD looks insane. And this week's LTD is Michael freaking Irvin. 97 speed, 95 jump, 97 spec, 97 deep route, 97 medium, and 94 deep. Holy, this card looks insane. He's going to get Cowboys chem and all the other promo chems that the LTDs get. This card will be 3 million coins minimum tomorrow. And this is just the start to the week. And wait till I go over the rest of the promos that we're getting this week because, geez, this is a start and a half right here. I'm going a little bit out of order, but if you look in the top left corner, the Season 4 Field Pass ends in about three days, which lines up with Wednesday or Thursday. So we should be expecting Season 5 this week. Um, the Season Update is usually one of the bigger updates we get. If you remember last season, it was a there was a title update. You changed the meta a little bit. And we also get some really, really cool cards. I think Season 5 is kind of a make or break for this year's Madden because a lot of people drop off playing after the Super Bowl. It's just a thing that happens. Less football, less players. You know how it goes. But if EA can drop a banger of a field pass, it's going to leave people to keep playing this game. I think we might see multiple 99s, at least one, hopefully. We're gonna see, we should see some more big names. We got Jerry Rice and Ray Lewis in the last field pass. Expect to see big names like that, if not even bigger. And also expect some really good rewards. We got we got some decent coin rewards. We got really good packs though, which also you can't go wrong with free packs. And I am season five, like I said, make or break for Madden twenty four Ultimate Team this year because of this drop off. So I'm expecting EA to make it a banger. How to prepare? Just finish your Season 4 pass. At least get to Tier 51. As you can see on my screen, you need that Season 5 XP token so you get the bonus XP at the start. Go claim that right when Season 5 starts. Get a little bonus. Get a little bit of ahead of your rest of the rest of the players. Also, if you haven't already, go exchange your Season 4 tokens for the 94+. plus. Um, I don't know if EA is going to get rid of that set, but just to be on the safer side, go exchange those tokens the next time you log in or go claim them because I know you won't be able to get them after the season ends. Go get them. Go get your free 94. I think it's actually 95, 96. The card, I picked the Rattler, a.k.a. He was really good for me. Go claim your free card. I promise you it's worth it. The next promo we're getting this week has to be the Combine promo. The Combine promo is not the Combine, not, not the promo. The actual Combine is this week in Indianapolis over the weekend. So we usually get a combine promo where we get really, really just cool players. On my screen, I got Cam Newton from Madden 22. Um, this promo, we usually get like a nice Chris Johnson, a John Ross for the 40-yard dash, an RG3 usually because he had a really good combine. I also think we might get a nice Tariq Woolen because he has one of the top 40-yard dash times of all time. We might get a new currency like the Genki Force if this is a Thursday promo, which I don't know if they're going to do that. This is such a busy week, but we definitely should be getting a Combine House Rules. I hope it's College OT kind of lines up, you know, College Combine. You know, hope they do that. This promo is always a super fun one. It's one that I look forward to because of my Commander's theme team. We always get a good Deion Sanders, Leon Sandcastle, if you know about that. Those cards are always just super fun. Combine promo is usually the start to the like spring Madden, and I'm it's one of my personal favorite promos that in Easter. 
So I hope we get the Combine promo this week because I'm looking forward to it. And yeah, the other promo I think we're getting this week, actually I know we're getting, it's Team of the Year. Combine will drop one day, Team of the Year will be a day or two after. If you don't know what Team of the Year is, it's just players that have played really good all year. Something EA has done differently over the last year, year or two is they're letting the community vote on who they want. It's, voting's been live for about the last two weeks. Voting ends soon, if not already ended. I'm not too sure about that. And we're going to get really, really, really good players. Uh, the players that we voted on were picked by EA, but then the community got to pick who we want. Reminder, you get a free one of these cards if you play all of the Team of the Week solos. So if you haven't done that, I don't know what you're doing, but go play your Team of the, year, team of the Week solos. This promo's coming out this week. I'm super excited for it. We usually get really, really good players. I remember my favorite team of the year last year, year of the two, was a Derwin James. I think it might have been last year. The card was my safety, my end game safety, because he was just so good. They're gonna drop end game cards tomorrow or on this week with this promo, so you don't want to miss out on getting your free one. Go play your team of the week solos. Go start saving your coins because also with the team of the year, other players that are really good at their position tend to tank. So either sell off some of your higher, more expensive cards and just get ready for this promo. Save your coins. Again, this promo, absolutely cracked. Again, this week, just in general, absolutely nutty. And I'm not even done yet. Another promo we should get this week is weekly wild cards. If you have been living under a rock, this promo isn't good. It's been just straight mid. It's really been used to get fillers in for theme teams. One cool thing they have been dropping is these Nike cards. We got a Sertain last week and a Kyler a few weeks ago. I don't think we'll get one of those this week, but just in case, you collect all those, you put them into a set that isn't released yet, you should get a 99 Nike Master. I think it could be Bo Jackson, just because, you know, big Nike athlete, or Jalen Hurts is another name I heard thrown out there. So, if you're interested in that, lock in, check in for those. But again, weekly wild cards, nothing crazy, but another promo we're getting this week. The next promo, or actually the last promo we're getting this week is UL's Ultimate Legends. I don't think we're going to get very good UL's. Um, I haven't even played my solos yet, to be honest with you. It's been a pretty busy week. Haven't I gotten up to it? Probably grind those out today. But that Sean Taylor that came out today or yesterday, whew, that boy has been a monster on my squad. But no, I don't think we'll get good UL's, but we're going to get them. This week is absolutely crazy, though. Um, if you enjoyed this video, learned something new, these are my promos that I'm expecting to drop this week. Again, like, subscribe, tell your friends, let me know what promo slash card you're excited to see. And with that, I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace, boys.